Hello and welcome to video number three. And we're going to talk about text that is wrapping the image. Now, this is very crucial. So I'm going to break it down as, as simple as I can. But uh, the best way to explain it is to by showing you what it looks like. So I'm at Google. I typed in the keyword roast beef recipe. And let's just take a look at some pages and get an idea of why Google might be ranking them higher than everybody else. So let's just take a look at the top images here. So let's go ahead and click this one here. I'm going to open that in a new tab. I'm going to do the same thing for this one and this one. So we'll do the top three. So this one was the first one. This says the best oven roast beef. So we're going to click on visit. Now, by clicking on visits, we're going to be sent to the page where the image has come from. And that will give us a better idea of what we're dealing with. So we can see that the image is definitely at the top. It says the best oven roast beef is tender, flavorful, and a perfect every time. Sunday Rose has been a tradition in our family for years. So, okay, wrapping text means the text that is surrounding the image. It does not necessarily need to wrap around it, but what is surrounding it? So obviously before it, we see roast beef, oven roast beef. We can see it's flavorful, perfect, classic recipe, roast, Sunday. So Google has a massive database of keywords. And it's very, very smart that it can figure out if the keywords that surround your image are legitimate or trying to game the system. So if it's going to read the text, we can see that the text in the beginning has already kind of set the stage for what the image is going to be. It's going to be a oven roast beef. Now, if we scroll down, we can see there's an ad and it says, how do you cook a roast in the oven? Don't be intimidated by oven roast. It's going to be easier. There are a few tricks to getting that buttery melt in your mouth, roast beef you love. So Google knows just by reading this, okay, it has something to do with uh, cooking roast beef in the oven, something about mouth that tastes good bring the meat to room temperature, it knows in that case probably that it's a recipe of some sort. So we can see these keywords like hot oil, sear on all sides, roasting pan, Dutch oven, all of these keywords relate. And when they combine them together in their own algorithm, they can figure out, okay, this is indeed a roast beef recipe. So there's an image here, people are clicking on the image, that's the reason why it's ranked up high. Now let's take a look at another one here. Let's click on visit. And I believe this one was the second image. We can see that the image is surrounded by text. And what's interesting to me is the format here is very similar to all the other ones. It's probably because it's posted on a platform such as simplyrecipes.com. So we got the text here, classic roast beef recipe, using rump roast, round roast, sirloin, low heat. See what I'm doing? I'm looking for keywords that Google is looking for. It says, my mother knows a thing or two about cooking beef. So cooking beef, cuts, cuts, local corner butcher, butcher, beef, pork, lamb, meat counter. So this is what I recommend that you do in your own niche is to type in the keyword that you're looking to rank on or the keywords that you're trying to rank on and look at what your competitors are doing. Look at the images that are at the top and try to get an idea of what keywords they are using, what jargon they're using so that you can get an idea of how to kind of mimic it yourself. Don't copy it necessarily, but put it in your own words, but get an idea of how things are worked out. So we can definitely see that these two blog posts have content 
and text that wrap around the image that are related. So we'll do the same thing here. We'll click on visit. We'll go to the web page. We'll read it here. We can see again, there's text in the beginning about roast beef recipe, the exact keyword. And this image actually is not only on the image SERPs, but is also on the main as well. So we can see that the difference here is they have not only text, but they also have a video. Now I will say a little tip is that if you put a video, especially a YouTube video on your page, that will get your page ranked higher. Google loves to see its own properties on your page. All right, so we can see we read around it. This is definitely how to cook a roast beef. Okay, so now that you see why the text that is surrounding the image is so crucial and so important, beyond that, how are you going to get keywords? All right, so that's the next question is where are you gonna get these keywords? So one way is simply go to Google, type in roast beef recipe, and just see what you get. So right here is what we call Google suggested keywords. These are keywords that drop down. And the reason why they drop down is because they are highly searched keywords. So in other words, in order to appear in the drop down, they have to be highly demanded searched keyword terms. So in other words, thousands and thousands of people are literally entering these in. So this gives us an idea of the different topics that we could potentially write on. So we got roast beef, slow cooker, oven for dinner, crock pot. We could also include these keywords in the wrapping text as well. Now, if you click that and you go to the, the main Google SERPs right here, you scroll all the way down to the bottom, you're gonna see a bunch of keywords here. Now, we could get more specific like roast beef gravy recipe. Scroll down all the way down to the bottom and see what kind of keywords they give us. And if they fit, I highly recommend that you include them in the text that is wrapping the image. And try to keep it simple, but try to make it interesting. Because at the end of the day, you are trying to appeal to the human being that is reading this. And if they like it, they stay on your page longer, and all the variables match up that we're talking about and the human engagement matches up, then your images are more likely to rank higher.